Hey, this is Scott, and today this is just a quick little video to talk about the Black Rapid Tether Kit. One of the main things that people are concerned about in terms of using a Black Rapid strap is worrying that the single point of connection will break and something will happen to their camera. I've personally never worried about it, it's always seemed like a very strong and sturdy connection, but uh, you never know when something could go wrong, either due to user error or a very rare malfunction. For that reason, Black Rapid made the safety tether, and I have the tether kit Breathe here, which has a couple of other accessories for just some different options and how you can use it. Basically, this provides a second connection from your camera to the strap, so in case of failure on the main connection, this will hold your camera and stop it from crashing. The tether kit in particular has two of these little straps, two carabiners of different sizes, two little key rings to connect to your camera, and a carrying case. So how to use this is just to remove this strap from the little uh, clip here and put it into your camera uh, the same as you would any other camera strap. Just loop it through here and then go back through this part and you can pull it tighter and adjust how tight you want it to fit to your camera uh, afterwards. But you'll take this other end which has a little loop on it and you're going to connect it to the Black Rapid hook actually before you connect that to your camera. This is not my favorite way to do it, but you can do it if you have only the strap uh, and not an extra carabiner or anything. But you just look that, uh, hook that onto the uh, little hook here before connecting it to your camera. And then, you know, if this comes loose, this connection will stop your camera from falling to the ground. Uh, so you just connect this and tighten it as you usually would, and you're good to go. If you get the kit, it will come with a couple of these carabiners, and you can actually connect this carabiner to this little loop on the end of the strap instead of connecting it directly to uh, the strap hook here. And then you can just connect this to your camera as you usually would. And you don't have to worry about doing anything before you do that. And it's faster and easier to attach and detach, I think. So then you're just gonna take this uh, carabiner and you can connect it either you know, to here or you can connect it to this little uh, joint here, or you could actually connect it directly to the strap itself if you wanted to. Uh, and just, it will have that second point of connection no matter where you connect it to. So if this comes loose or if this breaks for some reason, it will again stop your camera from falling. And once again, depending on where you can connect it, you can pull this tighter so that way it doesn't get in your way. You can have it fit really tightly to your camera and then hook it onto this part here. Um, there's a lot of different ways. It doesn't get in the way and it, it makes a little bit more noise than usual because it, it has this carabiner clicking up against here, but it will keep your camera safe and it is easy to uh, remove and attach. It's faster to remove and attach than if you're using this just by itself without the carabiner, but both ways can work. It's a simple product that does its job or hopefully doesn't have to, but it provides you the peace of mind. So if you're at all worried about the connection on your Black Rapid strap, I highly recommend you check it out. At this price, it's definitely worth it. If you only need one single strap without the carabiners, it's under $5. If you want to see anything more on any Black Rapid straps in particular, I have videos on a bunch of them, so be sure to check out my playlist. I'll put a link down in the description as well as links to these parts that I talked about today if you want to see more about those. If you have any questions or comments, be sure to leave those down below. If you like this video or found it helpful, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to see more in the future, and as always, thank you for watching.